after many years of attempting to do this well out on location and working with students, one of the things that came up for me was really this attitude shift of, of the painting being precious. When we work on location with the landscape, there's no stopping it, there's no freezing it. That's the comfort of the studio. We can have photography or our sketches and our reference material that's not moving, so we can take our time and make decisions and not get lost with the subject. I'm going to give you, you know, just my feelings about what one of the strongest secrets here in painting well is to embrace the patterns, the shapes, and then these values that we're going to get into and make that your focus, realizing that you can always add more detail later. Instead of methodically me with great accuracy trying to attempt to put every limb and every branch in exactly the place that it's positioned in my reference, what I want to do is get the gesture, the character of that tree. You know, how do these limbs work off of these old fir trees, these old pine trees? And if I can indicate that texture, that's like the attitude of what's there, then the viewer picks up the same thing. The viewer knows what it is. They pick up those tendencies and finish it. This is an illusion. And the more you understand how the audience is going to perceive those nuances that you place into the painting, the more powerful your magic is going to be when you do it.